Hey yo, what's poppin'? Party people, I'm that one dude Chris from YouTube and welcome to Mimic Search. I have a question for you. Just how do you know that the person you're talking to is that person? How do you know that the content creator you're watching is that person? How do you know that you yourself are you? I, I genuinely have no idea where I was going with that. Um, Mimic Search. You play as a detective and you're trying to solve the case of some missing persons, I think. And there's mimics going around. No, not that one. The other mimics. You know, the people that will go around pretending to be other people. Anyways, um, I don't know where the music is, so I'm most likely going to throw my own music in. Without further ado, hop right into this shit! Mimic Search. Made by Gim Jimzel? Jimzel? Hey! I think, I don't know if I'm 100% sure on this one, but I think this game was made by the same person who made uh, Missing Hiker, which is a game that I played earlier. Oh! Aw, oh, man! I can't crash the car? Nah, there's gotta be a way for me to crash the car. Come on, come on. I'm a bad driver. Gimme. Give me the juice. Oh, uh, you've got to be fucking with me. Oh, I got a laptop over here. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, emails. Briefing. Nathan. From Nathan. Subject briefing. Okay. Hello. A few hours ago, we received an anonymous call from someone reporting an abandoned car with a lot of blood next to it. You know what that means. Investigate the crime scene. After that, drive around the area. Use your map. Talk to people and ask if they've seen anything weird. If you encounter a mimic, neutralize it with your firearm. Don't get concerned. Mimics are highly trained predators. Good luck. Kind regards, Nathan. Oh, shit. So we got the trailer park, the gas station, which means that we're somewhere around here. This is the road that we come in on. Uh-huh, uh-huh, okay. Okay, for sure. So I'm just gonna go back, talk to the chief of police, who I assume that that important person was, and not some random person who may be a mimic. What seems to be the situation here, John? So, what do we got here? An abandoned car, a lake of blood, and no body, and no valuables are missing. So, probably a mimic doing its work, huh? Hey! Hey, they're speeding! That's official police business! Ah, we'll let him go with a warning this time. Yes, I think that's obvious. The car was smoking when I arrived here. I think the victim was driving up this road and... Alright, fuck you too then! You know what? No, hold on. You're so, oh, you're so lucky I'm in the middle of dialogue. The victim called roadside assistance while a mimic was hiding behind a bush. That thing was probably one of the big ones. There's a huge footprint in front of the car. She didn't have a, cha a chance. How old is the victim? 37 years old, according to her ID. Is this area known for mimic activity? No, not at all. But it seems like they're expanding their territory. I bet the fucker is still close. Probably somewhere in the woods. Digesting her. You're sent to... You're sent to take care of it. Yes, that's why I'm here. I'm tasked with finding and neutralizing it. I'll drive around the area and ask if someone has seen something suspicious. Sounds like a plan. You have a map of the area on your laptop, right? Yes. Yes, I have a map. Sounds good. If you want, you can take a look at the crime scene yourself, in case I missed anything. Will do. See you back at the station. Stay safe. No, I think you should definitely come with me. All right, let's see. The handbag of the victim, nothing was stolen. Are you sure about that? Cigarette is still warm. Looks like this was the victim's last one. Shame? The victim's car staying inside would have been safer. Would it? We sure? A lot of blood, not a single piece of flesh. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. That is a huge footprint. I investigated the crime scene. Probably belongs to the mimic. How deep into the woods can I go? Into the unknown. 
Into the unknown. Into the unknown. Bing bong. Official police business. Or I guess official detective business. What can I do for you, sir? There was a mimic attack just down the road. Damn, that's bad for business. Do you know anything that could help me with the search? I haven't noticed anything weird so far. Everything's just as always. Really, nothing at all. No, only thing I know is that you should be very careful. Nowadays, there's extremely good at Nowadays, they're extremely good at pretending to be human. And they're more dangerous than ever. People say they're evolving, learning from humans. Thanks, but that information is already known to us. Anyways, thanks. <laughs> I said thank you, but thank you again. Don't worry. Oh, don't you want to buy something or fill up your car, sir? I'm good, thanks. As a matter of fact, I'll actually take, like, uh, some Rice Krispies, I'll maybe get a, a, a Twinkie if you have them. You got brownie brittle? Good luck with your search, officer. No, but like the brownie brittle. Do you by any chance have brownie brittle? Bro, I'm parched. I'll take a cup of water. This water jug is empty. False advertising. Cancel the grocery store, man. So according to the map, there should be a fork in the road that I can... Either go to a trailer park a mot or a motel. And then from there, they both lead to the farm. Which one do I want to go to first? Trailer park? Trailer park sounds about right. It's a beautiful night for some tunes on the radio. Beautiful night for some tunes on the radio. I don't know why I'm not jamming out. That would be my own. If I were in a situation like this, if I were an investigator investigating the disappearance of like people and you know, mimics were running rampant, I would most certainly be trying to figure out a way to keep my mind at ease. What's good, gangy? What the fuck do you want? Easy there, pal. I'm just here to ask a few questions. People don't like cops around here. Make it quick. I'm here for an investigation. A mimic was active in the area around the nearby gas station. Shit. That's where I get my beer. Ah, fuck that place. Too expensive anyway. Do you know anything that would be useful to me? Or are you just gonna like be dismissive about everything? Are you a mimic by any chance? No, I'm drinking all day. <gasps> Nothing else to do around here. People here don't believe the official narrative. They say the government uses them to keep the population down. They don't like us common folk. <gasps> I, I I use them to get rid of to get rid off of us. <laughs> what? I think I'm confusing myself trying to sound drunk. This is not true. Otherwise, we wouldn't try to neutralize them. So, have you noticed anything odd in the last days? No, not at all. Everything is as always. Try your luck somewhere else, cop. Good night, sir. All right. What about you? I'm not talking with cops. I just want to ask a few questions. As I said, I'm not talking with cops. All right. All right. Listen. I'm technically not a cop. I'm a detective, which are two different things. Detectives are not cops. Detectives are special forces who investigate. I should stop while I'm ahead. I'm going to piss off some people. <laughs> I'm gonna piss off some people by making false statements. That's crazy though. You're telling me nobody around here has seen a damn thing about any of these mimics? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Sir, is there any reason why you were out this late? What's up, pal? Your car broke down? No, oh, the engine just got a bit hot. I'm waiting for it to cool down before driving off. What do you need, officer? We have reports that there could be a mimic around this area. Do you know anything helpful? Yes, it's me. Very funny. You do know that stupid jokes like these can land you in jail. Sorry, officer. It was a bad joke. <laughs> as far as you know. I'll let you off with a warning. I think that's what he said. I have to continue my search now. Stay safe, officer, and good luck with your search. So nobody knows a thing. Nobody knows 
anything about this mimic. You gotta be kidding me. The whole town full of people. Can I search your car? I have a warrant. I think. Am I a detective or a cop? I, I think, I genuinely think that I'm a cop. I thought I was a detective, but given that I'm driving a police car and I'm just now realizing that I'm driving one. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, trailer. If I went that way, we'd be back to the gas station. The farm is this way. The motel is that way. So I should be coming up on the farm, right? The farm should be on my left. If I'm going the right way. Yeah, I think I see it right there. Ooh, y'all see the driving skills? Quit playing with me. Come on. You know I'm a professional reckless driver. Uh-uh, this farm looks a little too abandoned for my liking. I'm not quite sure how I feel about being out here. Flashlight on. I have yet to experience any jump scares in this game. Keeping my guard up high, but I wouldn't be surprised if I still get jump scared somehow. My gamer instincts are tingling. Something's telling me that I'm going to have to come back here when, like, the power goes out or something. Because there's a generator sitting right here and there's a toolbox here. So I'm either going to need to turn some power back on or I'm going to need to grab some tools. Somebody's going to be like, ah, I have left my tools at the farm. Can you go grab them for me? I'll be like, sure. Because I got nothing. <laughs> May I help you, officer? Yeah, can you not scare the fuck out of me next time? I am armed, and I see that you are too, so let's not let's not go at each other's throats here. Damn, you scared the crap out of me! Are you the owner of this farm? Yes, this is my property, sir. I'm here because we have reports of mimics in the area. Do you know anything that could help me? Let me think for a second. Not really. I haven't noticed anything weird, but I also heard rumors about people seeing or hearing them in the woods. I personally don't fear them. I make sure to lock all my doors. I keep my rifle close to me. I sleep with it. My wife tells me that it's a problem and someday I'm going to shoot myself with it. But I tell her, woman, I'd leave you in a heartbeat if it meant keeping my gun close to me. Thank you for your time. If you notice anything weird, make sure to forward that information to the police. Have a good night. Good night and stay safe. I'm gonna go fuck my chuck. <laughs> what if this whole place, what if I am the mimic? What if I have become so good at fooling myself that I don't realize that I'm the mimic? Yo, I'm calling it now. I don't realize that I'm the mimic because I, I've been so good at becoming human. Human? Oh, dog, I'm calling it now. I am the mimic. That's a good theory right there. Oh, oh shit. Uh, special police business. Don't mind the incident. Don't mind the accident. Oh, please fix this door. May I help? No, wait, hold on. Hmm. What kind of voice do I want to? You know what? Fuck it. I'm the narrator of this story. May I help you, sir? I'm here because a mimic was active down the road. Do you know anything that could help me? A mimic, you say? Damn. I just hope I'll never meet one of those things. I myself haven't noticed anything weird. But there's a farm east from here. Maybe they can help you more than I do. You could also follow the road up north. This is an area that used for camping. All right, thank you for your time. Everybody here is so fucking useless. There's nobody here who has any goddamn information about this mimic. This oh so treacherous mimic that's been causing havoc everywhere. If they're such a big deal these days, then like somebody, oh, uh, there's gonna be something that pops out of these windows. I guarantee it. I'm waiting on it. I'm waiting on it. Oh. Okay. 
All right. All right. See, my guard wasn't up when I was at the farm. I said that my guard was up, but it wasn't really up. My guard was pretty low. And I'll admit it. I can admit when I was wrong. I can admit when I've done something that I shouldn't have. But you know what I won't do? I won't back down. No, I won't back down. Oh, why is this window open? I don't like that. So if we head straight, we'll hit up the cabin and the camping site. So I think I'm gonna go to the cabin first because the motel manager gave me directions to the cabin, which I feel like that may make some progress. And I think that the camping site is gonna allow me to progress while going to the cabin. Wait, no, this is the gas station. Oh, shit. Shit. I went the wrong way. I would be absolutely terrified to drive like in a wooded area when there's a mimic around the area. Cause like, what if it runs out into the middle of the road, you hit it and then you do the stupid thing that everybody in horror movies do. You get out of the car to check on the civilian and it turns out, boom, it's a mimic. They kill you. They have now taken your place in society. Was there just a singular camper out there? Not happening. I'm gonna check out the cabin first. Cause I'm not, <laughs> I'm not that stupid. I know progression in a horror game when I see one. I'm not that stupid. You there, ogre. Oh, I'm scared of you. You don't seem right. Got any spare change, officer? Sure, here, take this. Thank you so much. I'm here to investigate a mimic report. Do you have anything to help us? A mimic? Oh, that's bad. Really bad. I hear scream soft sometimes at night. Do you see this road going up there? I think there's a house. And? The screams are coming from there, I think. You should take a look. I guess I'll have to. Thanks, and make sure to stay out of trouble. I will, officer. Okay. All right. So I think that is the cabin. That they may be referring to. So I'm going to turn back around and go to the campsite. Talk to some NPCs there. See if they got any information, some useless information. So, oh, so useful and useless information. Right, no jump scares, please. No jump scares. No jump scares, please. Be prepared. Be prepared. Hello, is someone there? What do you want? I'm a police officer. I'm here to investigate a mimic related incident. Can I talk to you for a second? We can talk, but I'll keep the door closed for my own safety. That's not an issue. So you know anything about the, anything that can help me? No, not me, but there's a homeless guy. Last night he came to my tent, wanted some change. He said some stuff about hearing screams coming from the woods. I thought he was bullshitting me or that he was on something. Anyway, if you want to talk to him, just follow the road eastward. Will do. Thank you for your time. Stay safe, as officer. I will. You too. Hey, I talked to all NPCs. Cool. All right. Let's go investigate these screams. Screams of the damned. I swear it. Like ever since I got serious about being a gaming content creator, playing video games has turned me into a completionist. I used to never care about achievements. And now every chance I get, if there's like a, if there is a remotely easy achievement that I can accomplish in a video game, I'm gonna go for it. I have been playing uh, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth and um, that game has some decent achievements in it as well, but like, a lot of the challenges that are in the game, a lot of the mini games have um, high rewards or high tier rewards for getting the highest scores. And I have literally wasted so much time. Wait, where's this cabin? Did I pass it? I think I passed it. Is it down this way? I don't think it is. Maybe it is. I'm just gonna go down just to check. No, this isn't it. This road is too long.
Oh shit, am I stuck? I got the car stuck. No. I got the car stuck. No. No. Fuck. I guess I'm footing it then. Sh shitty tits. Oh my god, this is gonna take forever. No! God damn it. <laughs> you know what? This is very fitting. This is exactly the kind of dumb shit that I get myself into. I. I would somehow. I would somehow wreck my vehicle, forcing me to foot my way through the mimic infested forest. And that's how I wind up in a horror movie situation. Because I tried to do something stupid. I did pass the motel though, so... If I keep going any further, I should make my way back to that homeless guy. Oh, but it's taken forever. I would honestly take a sprint button and a stamina meter if it meant I could move significantly faster than this. I know that most of the game is meant to be played in the car, and I chose the worst place fuck up my to, to fuck up the car but Jesus because I guarantee you I'm gonna have to run away from the mimic or I'm gonna have to like shoot the mimic down and I, I need distance between me and the creature but I can't have said distance if oh I think I see the cabin I'm going for it I'm going into the woods oh I don't like this I definitely don't like this. I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan. Ooh! Official police business! Hello! I'm here to... Someone is screaming. Yeah, you think? I should save my ammo for when I need it. Oh, I'm getting chills. I have chills right now. Am I getting closer? Oh, I definitely do feel like I'm getting closer. Okay, but like dead ass? Where are you at? That sounds significantly closer. Give me one more good scream. Ooh. Where? 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 Wrong way. You're going the wrong way. Which way is the right way? Get down on the ground! <laughs> you neutralized the mimic. Okay, that wasn't as scary as I thought it was going to be. Not knowing where it was coming from was probably the scariest part. Okay. So that was Mimic Search. We found and neutralized the Mimic. And I'm sure there won't be any more Mimics left to terrorize the, the great people of this town. My theory was incorrect. <laughs> My theory was incorrect about me being the Mimic. But I guess I should have expected that, because that would have been kind of weird, unexplainable. I don't, I don't know. I'm not quite sure what I was expecting from this game. <laughs> it was something different. It was something unique. I wanted to play it. It seemed like a short and sweet horror game. I got a couple of good jump scares out of it. Two, maybe? One or two? Something. Subscribe if you're new. Tell your friends, tell your family, tell your dog. 
like the video? If you want to see my last video, which was Slay the Spire, I recommend checking that out. I'll have that link somewhere around here. If you're interested in those card building RPG games, check it out. I'll also have Missing Hiker linked somewhere around here, which is a game that reminds me, this reminds me a lot of Missing Hiker. If you watch the video, you'll see why. <laughs> this is such a sloppy outro. Oh my God. I'm gonna get out of here. I love you guys. Stay safe out there. Take it easy and big body out. No Mimic is taking me out today. No Mimic is taking me. I'm him.